My name is Ronald Starkweather, and I am bringing you a news flash all over the world. There's a bunch of motherfuckers. Matter of fact, every motherfucker is getting back on their bullshit. Nationally, the bullshit levels have risen to the level of orange. That we do have correspondents all over the world, all over New York, and every part of the motherfucking hood city and five boroughs, and every country and every state. We are now going to throw it to my man, Chaz Cunningham, in the field, all right? Reporting to you the latest, greatest bullshit. Chaz? Yeah. Thank you very much, Ron. Now, my name is Chaz Cunningham out this motherfucker, and we on BTV. And I just want to bring it to your attention that shit is so fucked up out here with this financial recession that even the stockbrokers is back on their bullshit. You heard me? I said even the stockbrokers is back on their bullshit. Matter of fact, we got a stockbroker motherfucker out here rolling dice right now. Mr. Stockbroker, Mr. Stockbroker, stock you yes. got any words for the people? Money, Don't that default on your loans. Shit. When you guys default on your loans, you the derivative market you fell through, and now I'm playing. Yo, get off my money! Man, fuck that. Give we me moving, some yo. Money. Let's get it. Yo, four, five, six, you want to roll? Five, six, yeah, I'm gonna fuck five, rolling. Six, I'm just gonna put this shit in my pocket. As a matter of fact, I need y'all to understand that there was a word from one of them fucking stockbrokers that's really back on his bullshit because of the crash of the economy. Now that is enough words from yours. Truly, Mr. Chaz Cunningham. Back to you, Ron. At Jefferson Elementary in Columbus, Ohio, administrators have declared recess as BYOB. You old young motherfucker look cute as hell, right? Finishing that motherfucker wild eyes rolls on by a goddamn self. Hey, shorty, next time you get you a little BYOB, bring your old bottle recess out there, you save me some of that motherfucker, because I'm back on my bullshit with you, homie. Stay tuned. We will be getting back at your ugly asses. When your love is rusted, and you know it can't be trusted, and for others he has lusted, see it all busted, busted, busted. Good evening, my beautiful people out there that got their eyes glued to the right shit that they need to be having their eyes glued to, and that's me, Big Jeff to the motherfucking left. I would just like to welcome all of you beautiful people to another wonderful episode of Busted. There is a married couple. Now, little Tommy been running his ass around with the little mistress in the wheelbarrow like in a motherfucking mud fight. He got the bitch up on the kitchen counters, he got on the motherfucking kitchen sink, he got her on the fucking face sink in the bathroom where you wash your face and brush your teeth at. They fucking on the fucking car hood and the garage and all that. Sheila feeling suspect about how this motherfucker's moving. So what she do? She got to come holler at Big Jeff to the left on this motherfucker. You know, I do what I does. I does my due diligence and I go figure out what the fuck's really going on. So I took that that I got on tape and I had to bring the situation back to Sheila. And unfortunately for you, Sheila, I got bad news. I have been with him for five years. Five f***ing years of sucking his dirty ass d and he got that trick up in there? Look, look. Oh. Oh, hell no. We need to go. You sure? I I'm ready. Let's go. I'm gonna kill him. You sure? I'm gonna kill I'm gonna f***ing kill him. Sheila, you know, I was wondering, mm -hmm. after we get to the bottom of this situation, mm -hmm. can we get to the bottom of our situation? <clears throat> Busted. Busted, coming right up.